Hello guys, JHS Halloween back with another video, and in today's video, I want to do um, a little project with you guys, and I got this idea from a few fans who wanted DIYs, and like building animatronics, building Halloween decorations. I got them from two or three different fans who wanted DIYs, so we are going to use um, whoa, 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 whoa. that foam and the huge piece of foam there. We're going to make tombstones. We're just going to try it out, see how it works out. So I'm going to do time lapses and um, different like sections, like showing what I'm at at the moment. So yeah, without any further ado, let, let's start this off. I want to do this. Right now, at the stage that I'm at, I currently have it uh, drawn, and I cut one edge, and it's looking pretty good, to be honest. It's actually looking pretty good. I'm actually liking it a lot. What I'm really excited for is not that one. That one's going to be kind of big. Oh, I thought I stepped on the wrong part. These are going to be two humongous tombstones. Like the size of that humongous one that was in my room in the Q&A, stuff like that. By the way, awesome questions. I love all of the questions. I'm so excited for 125 subscribers so I can do that Q&A. But anyways, let's continue on with the time lapse. And the next update will probably be when this is all cut out. I have it all cut out, and, and I definitely went for the wrong for trying to do a curved one at first. I should have gone for a cross. So it's not the coolest looking one because it's the first tombstone I've ever made. Because I'm, I'm not really sure how these things are made exactly. There is a crack here, but I think that's okay. That's fine. We're going to now start drawing on all the details, and I'm going to just try to carve them. We'll see how it works. Okay guys, so I'm back with an update, and so far we're at this. So we did carve down. It looks, it's gonna look okay with the paint on it, but that is it so far. Now, I know it's a little bit off center, but it is really hard making it center. But the only thing that I can think of doing next is a name in a year. But I think I'm only gonna do a year down here because the name would be hard. And the, the year will probably be 1927 to like 1978. Eight? I don't know. Something like that. So let's do it. Now, I know the date is not the best, but it's really hard to do this, guys. It was actually really hard just to do this. So, um, I'm thinking I don't really want to leave it uh, so blank. So, I am thinking of something, but I might... Like, I'm thinking... Should I put my YouTube channel here as, like, the name? Just for this tombstone, not for the rest. Just for this one. Should I? I think we should. Let's do it. I couldn't fit the whole name, so I just did YouTube and then JHS Hallow, because I know if you search up just JHS Hallow, it will come up. So let's start um, cutting this out. And finally, the first tracing of the tombstone and cutting is done. So here it is, and we just now need to paint it. 
but I think we're going to do the other two tombstones and then paint all of these at once. So let's clean this up and move on to the next tombstone. This is the next tombstone and this is going to be a cross, not the way this circle was. This is going to be a cross, so let's do it now. Did the quick drawing, so there it is. And now we need to do the time lapse of me cutting this thing out. Okay, so I'm done the second one, and it's not the best. I don't really like it that much. I really messed up the numbers. Like, I don't, like, it's really bad. But I'm still going to keep it. The other one is a lot better. But this is it. This was part one. Part two will be those two humongous ones, and that will probably be tomorrow. So without any further ado, I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.